What's up my Earthex? We are going to replace the camera glasses on this Samsung S22 Plus. The tape that you see has been added to avoid any broken glass from falling inside the device. The repair difficulty of this repair is 5 over 10. At first we are going to hit the area where we have the camera glasses for something like 30 seconds and then you need to use a sharp metal tool. I'm using a green scalpel. This is my green scalpel that I use for all my glass replacement on all kind of devices. You can use a hair dryer in place of the heat gun and you can use a small knife, a knife with very thin blade in place of the green scalpel. The camera glass is heated at the right temperature. You can see the blade goes under the double-sided tape and I started to lift the double-sided tape with all the glasses attached on it. This repair is very easy if you have some kind of experience with putting things together. The first camera glass is out. We are going to move on to the second camera glass. You just need to do the same thing as the first one. You need to insert your blade right below the broken glass and you need to start pulling the whole thing with the non sharpened side of the blade. In case you remove only a small portion of the broken glass with the double sided tape, you can just do the same on the other side that is still stuck to the camera bezel. I will have for you a back glass replacement on the Samsung Galaxy S22 Plus on my next video. The difficult part of this glass removal is to avoid having broken pieces of glass being stuck inside the device. That is something that can damage your camera sensors and you will have to replace the whole camera module. It is extremely important to test all your cameras. You have three cameras on the back of your device. You need to test all three cameras to make sure everything is functioning normally. And then you can move on to the installation of the glass. This is something that I didn't like about this glass replacement. They sent me the double sided tape on one side and the glass on the other side. So I had to attach the glass with the double sided tape together before installing the glass onto the camera bezel. Before you purchase a camera glass replacement, make sure that you purchase a camera glass that has the double sided tape already attached to it. It is going to make your life easier and you will not have to do this small thing that I am doing with the camera glass and the double sided tape putting everything together and then applying some pressure on the small circle that I can apply pressure to avoid having fingerprint on the glass. Also it's more time consuming so get the glass with the double sided tape already attached on it. Two camera glasses already installed. I try to apply a little bit of pressure on the camera glasses for them to stick onto the camera bezel. And then we can move on to the next camera glass that we're going to prep first. And then for the installation, it is very easy. You just have to align the camera glass with the circle it has to sit in. Everything aligned, apply a little bit of pressure on all three cameras. And then you can inspect the camera glasses and make sure everything is good. And subscribe, like, and share. And I will see you on my next video.